Okay, full flaps on, because that's what this plane was meant to do. We can fly high in the sky with any airplane, any day of the week, right? Let's get you this can. puppy in. Oh, you can. <laughs> okay, right. Look at this. Here we go. It likes that wind. It really likes that headwind. That's what we had there. But look at that, Abby. Thing of beauty. That's a thing of beauty. That's awesome. Oh, behind the shrubs. Oh my God. Woo. <laughs> 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 Woo! Wow, that was scary. Mixing in that rudder here. Oh, oh! I was saying goodbye to my airplane and goodbye to Norman oh, right Norman. there. <laughs> Norman's a good little pilot in here. <laughs> good little co-pilot. Thanks, buddy. After seeing Abby maiden this crop duster, the air tractor by E-Flight, the only thing it's missing is actual spray or dust of some kind to come out of this as you're low passing. What a beautiful plane. This thing belongs in anybody's collection, just as a shelf queen. Don't even need to fly it, but guess what? It flies, and flies really well. Today we're gonna have some fun with it. Although I think probably watching Abby's Maiden is more exciting than whatever I'm going to come up with today. I uh, doubt it. I did left-hand circles. Left-hand circles. Don't but make it was fun exciting. of me. It was exciting. I'm not making fun. I'm saying that was exciting to watch. <laughs> I don't know about that. Listen, the crop duster that I had by Dynam couldn't fly in a drop of wind. I mean, when the winds picked up to 0.5 miles an hour, it was like, can't handle it, need to land. And we showed that in the two videos that we did, but this puppy can handle the wind. It does a very good job because of the AS3X stabilization and the safe technology built on board. Absolutely love the bind and fly setup. If you're looking for something that is possibly your first low wing airplane, I'd say this is right on the money. I don't know that it could be, I mean, it could be a person's first RC plane, but I'm gonna go with a strong second plane. There are some wonderful trainers out there that are just a little bit more durable, a little more forgiving than this. Not that this isn't, I just think that there are some geared towards beginners a little more. Abby, you did a good job. You really did. Now I'm ready to have some fun. This thing has beautiful lights on board. We've got navigation lights on the wing tips, really light bright lights up here on the front of the plane. Just generally to scale, it is spot on. Down to the pilot that Abby named Norman. Norman so gonna, better hang on tight today, I have a feeling. We're gonna give Norman a ride for his money today. <laughs> the ride of his life. Yes, that's right. <laughs> really nice with a, just a five channel receiver is all you really need to get this in the air if you're going with a plug and play version but honestly if you're buying this plane and you're not getting the bind and fly with spectrum set up I, I think you're doing it wrong that's just my personal opinion it's made to fly with that okay we're gonna put this in the air on one of our awesome 3s2200 smart batteries I would not fly on anything else other than those packs and on that pack the goal for me in this video too is going to be to give you guys a flight time Abby's flight we, we had it in the air for a total of like 13 minutes because we did some slow-mo shots and stuff too and it still wasn't giving us a low indication on the battery strength so I want to give you guys an accurate flight time at the end of this video it's going to be broken up probably with some race room shots and stuff so Abby your flight is probably gonna be shorter too because you're gonna punch it a lot yes more. I'll be punching it more with this awesome three blade prop we're gonna be doing some nice higher throttle low flat passes really putting this thing through the ropes especially on a windy day I do think it'll fly better on a, on a lower wind day but whatever we're gonna have some fun let's fly 
Norman, buddy, hang on tight. Hold on, buddy. Now, the wind is actually directly to our backs. That's a strong cross breeze. So I'm going to commit to a takeoff straight toward us. I wanted to show you guys <laughs> oh, taxiing this plane because I rarely do uh, show the taxi. This one's just, it kind of looks good on the ground too. So let's drive it out there like a car. I'm going to put full flaps on. Abby's like bracing herself. You ready for this? Yep. Safe is on and we're up. That was that oh, easy. Wow. I'm talking like... That was good, mate. Two feet, probably. I put the flaps up. We have safe on right now. I want to show you guys what we can do with safe on. The confidence that I'm shooting for here. Wait, what are you? What are you doing? I'm flying. <laughs> what do you think I'm doing? This is a crop duster. <laughs> okay, so you're. Oh my gosh. Uh -huh. <laughs> Mm -hmm. So you're going to fly so, really low the yes. whole time? Yes, and, and I love that we've got safe on to help me in this wind. I don't even have the flaps down right now. I want to try my best. My goal is to keep this puppy below the tree line as much as possible. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm playing yourself. with the throttle and the elevator a lot to do this, uh, but mixed with safe, my confidence is just soaring. So then we fly up, we come around. I mean, you have like a five to ten mile an hour constant. Constant, yeah, breeze. and maybe like fifteen mile an hour gusts, yes, especially yeah. when we get higher. Now the wind being uh, coming in the other direction, hey, it's slowed down some. So let's get it a little bit lower, keeping it below that tree line, spraying those crops. That's what we're doing, or maybe we're dousing the fires. Either way, isn't that awesome? Just keeping it nice and low, really low to the ground. That's how I like flying this thing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think this is the lowest I've flown any large plane, Abby. You're like touching the wingtips down. Yeah. Now, let's blast it. Let's come around. Let's turn safe off on this pass and do a nice roll. Oh yeah. Give it a little loop action. We can handle that. Then, we'll turn safe back on. Let's lower the flaps to full because we have done zero passes with full flaps yet. And the wind actually picked up too. So this, this should be fun. This should be a little challenge. We're gonna come in low and slow. We're gonna really get our bang for our buck. What am I saying? I don't know. Uh, that's, see, I struggle to talk. While it's hard. Too. Uh, well, the wind kicked the wind up. Look at that. Crazy. Look at that. Oh, we're like two inches off the ground. I was trying to say best bang for our buck on the on the crop duster. I think Whoever Norman knows. was bracing himself for a crash right there. Yeah. <laughs> I like having safe on with uh, with those really yeah. low slow passes. But when we go this way, we're going a little bit faster. We can just roll it. It is a little bit of a slower roll, which I think is fair for this type of plane. Well, let's hit one going this way. Boom! I don't think you usually see crop dusters doing loops. Not and a rolls. lot. No, no, not a lot. But it's kind of cool that it can do it. What do you guys think? This is awesome. Woo! <laughs> AS3X is on, but safe is off for this this little part here that I'm. It's so funny around. the difference of our attitudes while we fly. <laughs> <laughs> you are like, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, and I'm like, Norman might die, Norman might die. <laughs> You're pumped. I love flying planes. I mean, it's just cool to challenge yourself. Look at that. Go oh, there, the wheels touched. I was trying not to touch, but they did. Oh, touched oh, again. Oh, we got a double touch. <laughs> Let's bring it around. Let's figure eight it here. Oh. oh, sorry, Norman. I saw a flashback <laughs> to your Zazzy right yeah. there. Hey, Death cartwheel. Valley is rough. I'm keeping flaps on this whole time just to keep you guys in the loop of what I'm doing. But I'll tell you what, I am not ashamed to say that safe is on this whole time too while I'm flying this low to the ground. That wind is nasty. Oh, it's nasty. I'm challenging myself though, you guys. Kevin, I was playing with the throttle and the elevator a whole lot. I'm also mixing in some rudder here on my turns to see how that handles. Uh, this is just a really fun plane that I'm boosting my low flying confidence with. 
What do you think of that wing wing drag there, Abby? <laughs> <laughs> when I told you I'm I wanted you to for fly, you already. <laughs> I told you I wanted you to fly low. This is what I meant. Uh, <laughs> gonna, no I'll, I'll show you guys what Abby was doing on the next pass here. No, oh, don't make fun oh, of me. Oh, I'm not making fun of you. I just it's a difference. <laughs> they can go watch my video. They should watch your video. Look at that. <laughs> How Are cool you shooting would it look? bullets out? Um, that was the engine sound, obviously. I don't know about that. Obviously. You need to work on your sounds. And I wonder if she'll fly inverted. Let's try that on oh, the next pass. Oh my gosh. I don't know. I thought I really... you were going to make fun of me on your next pass. <sighs> no, no. I'm trying to be, <laughs> trying to be nice. Okay, let's try a little inverted. I mean, we've got some nasty wind, so bear with me here. Oh yeah, I think you can do it. Okay. Uh, let's Dude, straighten that out some. What is some. going on there? Yeah. That's my five minute timer on the radio. Nice indication. Okay. There we go. That looks yeah. better. It's, it's okay. I'm having to give a little more throttle than I'd like, but... Hey, she can fly inverted. I'll try to get a little bit closer so you guys can actually see it. Nate, I got good camera work. You don't oh, even okay. know. You don't even know. Oh, okay. <laughs> Thank you. That's a little closer. See, your camera work always makes me look like a tiny dot. Uh, I know. I'm not great. <laughs> nah, not you're, great at the camera. You're a little. Now let's see. What me. if I hit safe while I'm upside down? Kachow! Brings it back over. Okay, full flaps on, because that's what this plane was meant to do. We can fly high in the sky with any airplane any day of the week, right? Let's yeah, get this can. puppy in. Oh, you can. <laughs> okay. Right. Look at this. Here we go. That likes that wind. It really likes that headwind. That's what we had there. But look at that, Abby. Thing of beauty. That's a thing of beauty. That's awesome. Oh, behind the shrubs. Oh my god. Woo! <laughs> Woo! Wow, that was scary. Mixing in that rudder here. Oh, oh. I was saying goodbye to my airplane and goodbye to Norman oh, right Norman. there. <laughs> Norman's a good little pilot in here. Good little co-pilot. Thanks, buddy. So if you guys bought this crop duster, what would you name Norman? <laughs> I think it should be like Safety Ted because he's got a safety vest. We've on. named a drone Safety Ted, so that name's Oh, that's right. That's way right. back in the day. That's right. It's a Safety Ted orange drone, right? Yeah, I think so. Let's let's see how the climbability is on this. Oh, I have safe still on. Uh, let's do it on the next pass. Forgot. Really having a good time with this. Basically, it's a an attempt of a landing every single pass I do. Can we do a nice touch and go? Double touch, triple touch, oh, quadruple, shush, shush, thousand touch. Here's the <laughs> I'm just climb. Kidding. Good job. Well, Good job. we should probably do it over there, shouldn't we? Because the sun. Let's yep. go over here and do a climb. Safe's off. Full throttle. Here we go. Climb. See when she'll saw. It's not going to climb forever. There yeah, that's go. about it. Here's zero throttle with safe off. See when she wants to stall. Not bad. Can do okay. Wow. Throttle. Not bad. I'll take that. This is a fun, 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 fun plane and looks really, really good. Head turner. As a matter of fact, someone stopped in between Abby's flight and now my flight at the airfield just to watch the flight of this um, and see it on the ground too because it's a beautiful plane. It just got bright out, didn't it? Mm -hmm. I can still see that light on the front of the plane yeah, and the navigation good. lights even in this bright light. Hold that rudder, hold that rudder. Yep, 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 yep. Need to get lower. Need to keep getting lower and slower. Oh, there's no wind, Abby. This is nice. You can just feel it. You can just feel it with no wind. Safe's back on. Let's lower those flaps and really see what we can do here. This should look good, nice and smooth. I hope this holds out. This is nice. The wind just completely stopped. Here we go. Look how silky smooth we can get it now as I bump the ground. Oh, I thought you meant to do that. That's all you had to say was, look at that touch and go, guys. Touch and Isn't go, perfect. <laughs> I knew what I was doing. Remember the goal here, too, is to get an accurate flight time on this because I was really impressed 
with uh, with Abby's flight. You're at almost nine minutes. That's amazing. Boom. Very good. Think I meant to do that? Oh no! Oh! That's okay. Hey, I was you getting did brave. So good. You I was did getting good. brave. Let's taxi it in. Uh, see if we. I think we've bent the aluminum landing gear. Let's. That's okay. <laughs> Let's go get it. How's it look? It's just the landing gear. The landing gear bent. Oh yeah, that back wheel. Look at that. Okay. Easy fix. Yeah. And fixed. <laughs> I just gotta bend this back a little bit. We're gonna get it back in the air. No actual damage, just aluminum bent, which is a really <laughs> good design. Rather it bend than break. So give me 30 seconds. Okay, that's about all I can do, bare hands. Um, I need a couple vice grips or something, just some pli some good pliers just to uh, bind it back into place. But other than a little bit of chipped paint, I think she'll fly again. Let's put it in the air. Best part about that is there's zero wind now. We can take off whichever way we want. And you know what? Oh, hey, forgot to put safe on on that. <laughs> I thought it was on, but doesn't matter. We got it on now. Awesome, flaps back up. Let's get this flight time going, Abby. I cannot believe I did that, but that's what happens when you just get brave and you're just showboating the whole flight. Yeah, you don't see a lot of people on YouTube fly like you were. Oh, uh, well, yeah, you're right. Not even close. I mean, you yeah. were pushing the limits. It was fun. To the extreme. It was fun. It was a lot of fun to watch. I'm going to still get low and slow. I'm not I'm not going to let that bent landing gear keep me away from doing that more, <laughs> but I am a few feet off the ground yeah. now. <laughs> I looked it up for you if you decide that you want it to look like completely new because the paint chips some and you don't feel like buying spray paint. It's only $18. Okay. For, for the whole landing, landing gear. gear set. That's not bad. Mm -hmm. But, hey, it bends, right? It yep. bent. And, I mean... Looking at it in the sky, can you really tell? I think my wheel's a little crooked there. Just a crooked wheel, that's yeah. it. Otherwise, hey, I'll get it bent back in place when I go home and I have the right tools. I literally was doing all that with bare hands, so. All right, let's uh, let's turn safe off, blast this into the sky, because at this rate we're never gonna run out of flight time. This is crazy, crazy, I crazy. I think you're crazy. on like 11 minutes or so. Do a roll. Good job. I think we can do a nice wide loop out here. Didn't have a lot of airspeed, and that was a little crooked, but that's okay. The sun just came out, <laughs> so I'm squinting now. Normally I have my sunglasses on. Safe back on. Getting low and slow. Look at that wheel. It's like, hey everybody, what's going on? <laughs> oh man. Norman's a little scared for his landing. I'll tell you oh, that. Oh, poor little crop duster. I'm sorry. That's okay. That's just part of the hobby sometimes. And you gotta take it, take it as it comes. Sometimes it's the foam that'll break. A little 10 cents of hot glue and you're back in the air. And this is just to show you guys, don't ever get discouraged. I mean, even trucks and stuff, they strip their spur gears and yeah, your pinion gear falls out because you lose your little set screw. I mean, all this stuff happens in the hobby, but it's part of it. And uh, hey, I should have I should have brought our, our tools. I have a nice little toolbox, a little go toolbox. Oh, no, no, not again, not again, Norman. What is with you two? <laughs> Norman has mine on his own. He says, "I'm ready to land, Nate. I'm gonna blow trunks." Look at that. That's no flaps. Just slow and steady. That's what this plane was meant to do and it just does a great job at it. Remember, the only reason I crashed was because I was showing off really low and slow and in a lot of wind too, so it's okay. The wind has calmed down. I mean, that was a pretty a hard now. hit and just for that one aluminum 
leg to get bent. Now this is safe as off. Practicing some loans lower and slower with safe off. Even myself, you know, I've probably Sorry, got close to a thousand total flights of planes under my belt. I still, uh, maybe not that much, maybe not. Uh, maybe, I don't know. I really wonder how many flights, probably hundreds. I still like to, I'll wait till that truck goes by. I still really like to, well, lunch break. Lunch break. <laughs> I still really like to rely on safe for certain things. I love having it assigned to a switch because you get low and slow and brave with safe on why not rely on that and then you want to show off a little bit you turn it off you climb up throttle up give it a little roll kick that safe back on a lot of my friends are flying this way abby's flying this way and i see the appeal i get it it's there take advantage of it awesome there's that wind kicking back up guys this flight time is ridiculous i turned my radio off and here we are pushing I that think you're at 14 one minute minutes. Little click. This is a crazy flight time. What do you say we cook it on a full throttle pass on this next one? Okay. Because I don't think we've done that. We're really doing a lot of low and slow flying today. Let's do, um, I'll turn safe off. Nah, I don't need to. Okay, here we go. Diving with full throttle. Uh, there's your lipo alarm. What do you think about that? There was your lipo I alarm. <laughs> That's because I'm cooking it. Well, I'll tell you what, let's let's practice a nice greased landing. I haven't been able to get a really smooth, that is, that is wacky wind over Death Valley. Do you see that? That's why it's called Death that Valley. That was awesome. Safe kicked in big time. That was amazing. Wow. <laughs> that was some wind. What in see the world? See how your bent landing gear hold up? Yeah, this is going to be a fun landing. Come on, how, how greased can I have it with, with a bent, a landing, bent gear. landing gear? <laughs> The wheel Full is flaps crooked. on, and let's do it. Oh, oh, oh! Oh, that was better than Good mine! Good job, Norman! <laughs> Truly unexpected, slightly embarrassing crash that that was. Sometimes the ego gets notched down just a little bit when something like that happens. To be very fair, that's where I'm standing right now. But our channel is not a, uh, it isn't a it's not a commercial. We are here to enjoy the hobby with you guys. I do this because I love the hobby. And this is all part of, not to put too much emphasis on that because it really wasn't that bad of a crash, but it just happened. You know, this is, the reality of it. We like to share those experiences with you guys. Abby's maiden of this plane was a mile high, but that's okay, because that was your first, that was your first real maiden of, uh, of such a high quality plane. And you, you rocked it. Thanks. And I was getting so brave and just, just having, you were having windy a lot of fun. A lot of fun. And in, this plane, the, in a lot of wind, you were very brave. Yeah. As I said, you don't <laughs> see a lot of people on the internet doing that kind oh, of stuff. Oh, well, this was a lot of fun. That's, to me, that's what this plane was meant to do, and I just, it's like limbo. Eventually, you're gonna catch that stick, right? I caught the ground, so, <laughs> hey, it's a lot of fun. It's meant to be flown low and slow, just not that low. <laughs> the the you crop were banking duster. it like crazy. I was, yeah, I really was. The crop duster, or the E-Flight Air Tractor, is officially my favorite RC crop duster. I've only had my hands on a few, to be fair, but this, in my opinion, I can't even imagine how it would get any better. What you get for that price, I think, is awesome. This is a premium airplane. It's just... I, mean, I see you zoomed in on the plane. <laughs> it is a beautiful plane, and even after the landing gear gets bent, look at that. Still rolls just fine. No problem, Norman. Guys, all the good stuff for this plane will be linked in the description box below. This is gonna be one that remains in our collection for a long time, proudly on display. I wanna get that landing gear bent back into place, getting it looking pristine and perfect again, and I'm so happy to have this. I highly recommend Spectrum paired with safe technology on this to get super low and slow passes like we were doing in the video. And if you buy this plane and you're not using Spectrum Smart Batteries, Come on, we need to have conversation. There's something wrong. Guys, remember, these batteries are just awesome. They storage charge themselves after X amount of time that you can adjust. 
of not being used. They're the safest batteries on the market and I'm slowly taking over. I mean, I wish I could, I should have showed you guys the progress. I recently got rid of four old batteries. I recycled some and of course those are gonna get replaced with more Spectrum Smart Batteries. That's what I'm doing. You don't have to pair with the new charger, but I absolutely recommend it if the money's there for you. Sell your old charger, buy the Spectrum Smart Charger. It's where it's at. They're safer, they're better, they perform amazingly well. And clearly, what do we get like a 20 minute flight on this? It was about 15 minutes. Crazy! Yeah. And I was cooking it and stuff too. So much fun. Before you guys go, I wanna say a huge thanks to all the names that are scrolling by right now and everyone that's in our description box too. Plus, all of our sticker loyalty reward people. You're amazing. More stickers are coming out to you. Before you click away completely, we've got this video that we really want you to check out. Actually, it's Abby's made in at this place. Thanks for watching. We'll see you there. Bye!